please hit the red subscribe button to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also click on the bell icon to get notification of my latest uploads. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be reviewing these newly launched L'Oreal Tinge Caress uh, Lip Stains. First, let's talk about the pricing of these lipsticks. Uh, these tints retail for uh, rupees 1050 on uh, Nika and all other sites, but you can get them at discount on Nika, which is going on right now. So you can get them at 840 rupees in case if you're interested in buying these. Now, I find them quite pricey for the product which you get. These are not long lasting uh, lip stains, so I feel that this is quite pricey. And only buy these in case if you get a discount on it. Now, uh, otherwise, I feel these are not worth the price. I feel. These come in 8 shades and uh, I would prefer picking up colors which are darker because I feel the lighter colors will not give you enough coverage to, uh, if you have pigmented lips you will not be able to get enough cover coverage to cover up those uh, pigmented lips so I think you must always pick up darker shades in this uh, range there are 8 shades available from light to dark so mind it when you want to select the colors please choose it correctly i feel you must go for the darker shades more than the lighter shades if you have really no pigmented lips then uh, go for the lighter shades i think it will look nice so let's talk about the packaging the packaging of these products is really nice it has that ombre effect going to gold now the ombre effect showing down represents the color of the lipstick or the color of the product inside I love the packaging uh, of these lip tints. I think they are really classy and uh, very beautiful looking. And the inside packaging is very unique. It comes in a sponge tip applicator like this and the color comes out from here, the tint comes out from here. The cap inside uh, is like a spring cap inside you can say. So when you push this inside, uh, it uh, compresses down with the use of with the help of the spring if you can understand what I'm trying to say and uh, then you can twist it up and close it tight now let's talk about the texture and the finish of this product on your lips how it feels on the lips and how it applies and the staying power of the product the texture of this product is quite uh, powdery I would say like you can see it's and you can also blend it out to you know use it as a blush or use it on your eyelids now these are not like usual uh, lip stains or lip tints which you used to get in a sketch pen or a felt tip kind of form uh, these have this sponge tip applicator in it and this is a sponge tip applicator and the product comes out from here and this is more like a powder which is coming out from here a liquidy mousse powder which comes out from here it leaves uh, like kind of a stain like a very natural kind of a finish on the lips it doesn't look as if you applied something the product is a powder finish and uh, you can use it as a blush on your lips uh, on your eyes you can create ombre effect with this like only uh, going dark on the outside or only going dark on the inside which is like a very famous Korean uh, trend right now where you just go darker on the inside and then you go very light on the outer side of your mouth these are like multitasking products you can use them for your cheek and for your eyes and on your cheeks it gives a very nice natural uh, flush of color and i think i uh, like it for that as well for using it on my cheeks and but for my lips i feel that these are okay like when you apply it it looks nice it looks very natural it gives you very fresh kind of a look but um, within one or two hours or within um, one or, uh, within uh, the time you have coffee or you eat something it starts fading away and within two or three hours it was like completely gone and I didn't have any lip tint left on my lips which was disappointing for the price I paid for these products I, uh, so I may disappoint with the staying power of these products and uh, I think it should have lasted a little longer but it didn't so I'm disappointed about the staying power the texture of the product on the lips starts feeling powdery and it does make your lips feel dry after a little while so make sure you scrub your lips well or you moisturize your lips well before applying this because if you have dry 
cracked lips this is going to enhance the texture of your lips and they're going to look really dry and cracked so this is all about the texture finish and the application of the product I picked up two shades in this uh, which is called Orchid Blossom and the other one is called Shakura Blossom this is the shade Shakura Blossom right here it's a very beautiful uh, everyday kind of pink which has a little bit of peach undertones and this is the shade Orchid Blossom which is more like a blue toned uh, pink again a beautiful shade uh, you, if you need to use these uh, for blushes you need to blend them as soon as possible and it will blend quite nicely so there you can see a swatch a blended swatch now I'm going to show you a demo on how you can use this product in multiple ways I'm going to use the orchid blossom on my lips These are quite easy to apply and they give you a, like a powdery kind of finish. So there you can see this is a shade Orchid Blossom which I've applied on my lips. And it does feel dry on my lips right now already. Uh, next I'm going to be using this shade called Shakura Blossom on my cheeks as a blush. All you need to do is apply and blend it out. you want you can also take a blender and blend out the edges I think it looks very fresh and natural on the cheeks and you can also use it for your eyes if you want all you need to do is apply it and then blend it out a little so these are the different ways how you can use this uh, tint caress l'oreal lipstick in uh, different ways as a blush for your cheeks or you can also use it on your eyes and you can also use it on your lips I think the product is very nice but uh, I do not like the staying power on the lips so that is it for my review on this product and different ways of using this product I hope you like this review and my demo on using these products please hit the like button if you like this video and do not forget to subscribe to my channel in case if you haven't already until next time, stay beautiful and timeless. Bye-bye.